Mary meet everyone I am Shiv Shakti from Goddess Breath and I am here to bring you the weekly reading from the 11th to the 15th of January 2016 let's see what the cards hold for us Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday and Friday Oh wow Okay So Monday and Tuesday is the Queen of Swords The queen is the queen is telling us about focus 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 which is also telling us that it's important first to dream the dream that you need to focus on it is extremely important that you remember to dream is what she's saying the mind is not only here for logical activity the mind is also here to dream the big dreams that you have to make a reality and dreams are little secrets from god that only you are given because if you were not able to manifest them you were not going to be the one given so you have to just you have to dream you have to dream and after last night's uh, dark moon it is the time for action because everything that you start today is going to really is going to manifest is going to become strong and it's going to become beautiful for you use red roses around you and butterflies transformation lots of transformation coming in allow your mind to be daring allow your mind to be bold and allow your mind to dream and as soon as your dreams are dreamt allow your mind to focus so monday and tuesday is about dreaming dreaming big and focusing on what really makes those dreams come true monday and tuesday wednesday the 10 of wands Yes it it does seem like there's going to be a little stress but not just stress it's more like burdens but the energy i am getting here is not just about burdens it's about the fact that you're picking on someone else's burdens don't let anyone trample your dream don't let them tell you that this is not a dream you should dream or that will manifest do not ever allow that to happen you have to lead your own life because you are living in your shoes nobody else is living in your shoes so the minute someone tries to tell you this is not going to happen i don't think it's you know it's right i don't think it's it makes any sense it doesn't make sense to that person but it makes sense to you and it is your dream it's your secret you know so you do not have to listen to that but the minute you feel burdened just stop for a second realize that this is not my thought pattern my thought pattern is successful my thought pattern is magical this thought pattern of burden of not having happening of um, i'm not sure is not me you stop there you change go back to the thought pattern that you have and start working forward you might have to do a little traveling midweek and uh, that might cause you a little stress as well you um it may be a slow very slow drudgerous travel but uh, if you change your mode of transport that will help and the weekend uh, no sorry not the weekend thursday and friday there you go happy card happy card happy card the three of cups the three of cups is party 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 all over for the ladies you might want to be careful because there's a possibility of a pregnancy on the on second hand there is a possibility of being you know uh, being in a space where you're spending a lot of girl time you know go out with the same gender have a lot of fun go out drinking go out partying go out um, you know and just just do mad things for yourself it's time to just lose all that burden and just know that this is fine you know so you're permitted this week just one minute just one just one minute on a wednesday to think it's not going to happen otherwise you do not have the luxury to think like that because you have to party 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 you have to have a great great time on the on the thursday and the friday i keep saying weekend <laughs> have a great time and uh, it also basically means that you, know, you need to check your water intake you need to check your blood levels you might also want to re uh, realize if you have any sort of water retention uh, because that might cause a little swelling in the joints Oh, that's Thursday and Friday for you. Oh yes, also lots of fruits, lots of green uh, vegetables, and uh, a walk, a walk, a good a walk, and good dancing, good dancing. Yes, good dancing. Right. So that was the week, and now one card that the angels have to give us for guidance. I hope this is clear. Maybe not. I'll read it out to you. Okay, it's leadership. 
Archangel Gabriel. She says it is fine for you to assume your leadership power and position and lovingly guide others. That is what the Queen of Swords said right at the beginning. You see, she has a sword and she has a trumpet, right? Right there, she has a trumpet. You have to realize that you do not need to drop the, the calling card. You need to get up and tell people, look, this is me. This is who I am and this is what I'm going to do. And if you want to join me, you're most welcome to do that. But before that, make sure that you are convinced of what you're doing. Are you convinced of what you're doing? Really? Is it exactly what you want to do? That is the most important question that you need to answer yourself this week. And the minute you do that, it is all an open road. It's, it's the neatest highway you've traveled and you're sitting in the best car possible. I think all you need to do is figure this out for yourself. Figure this out for yourself and that is happening on Monday and Tuesday. So today, it starts today, it starts today. I know you're going to have an awesome, awesome weekend. I keep saying weekend. I know you guys are going to have an awesome, awesome week. And tell me how you felt. Tell me if this reading makes sense to you. Write a comment below and I will wait to read. You have a great, great week and I'll see you again on Saturday. Mwah.